Why is it that I don't know you all from a can of paint, but I can sit here and analyze how you should communicate with each other? That's all you have to do with each other. Because clearly there's a relationship here. You have now moved, it sounds like, three different places to be with this man. And this man seems like somebody who is doing the best he can to provide a nice uh, living experience for you all. Why aren't you able to communicate? And I'm going to start with you, Ms. Thomas. What's going on that is preventing you from communicating? Tell me so I can help you fix the problem. I do have a problem with bottling up my feelings. Like, sometimes I don't know how to express myself. And I tell him, we have communicated that, like, I would rather calm down and we come back to try to find a solution. But when I'm upset, I just simply don't want to be bothered. Like, I would leave at the house. I would block him from contacting me. He knows that I'm going to come back. Where else am I going to go? I'm sorry, but Ms. Thomas, there are other solutions other than fight or flight. <laughs> Do you understand what I'm saying? Because that's what it sounds like. The only thing you all know how to do is fight or leave. And how is that a family? Mr. Smith, am I interpreting that correctly? You are. You are. You are. You are interpreting it very correctly. Um, it's just like, I get what you're saying. I'm not trying to just go back and forth with her because I love her. But I get what you're saying. It's just like, I want to know, like, why do she do the things that she do? Like, I have a video. Um, of her damaging my clothes, and I found that she took all of my clothes, all of the clothes that I bought, the white clothes, I dress up every day, I wear suits and stuff like that. She took my suits, she drug it through the mud, and it was all damaged. You I have, have this a evidence? I did I not video. drag anything through I have a the video. mud. You know I what? Up, I always I up prefer all day watching all of that. I would like to see the video. I would like to see the video. video. Let's go to the videotape. Look at what you did my stuff. What happened, Ms. Thomas? That was both of our clothes, first off. And that same incident was the same day of the Mercedes being simple. I kept telling him, like, I've been in here all day washing. I didn't even get a chance to really wash my own clothes. I had to put all of my stuff into storage. I dedicated all of my time into Why'd washing. Why'd you damage the clothes, either your clothes or his clothes? I was upset. I was upset. He took see, my toe. See what I you mean? Took, when she you gets took upset? My, you took my toe and threw my toe down the stairs. And I said That's to you, yes, you did. That's a lie. Yes, you did. A lie. Yes, you so, did. Ms. So. Thomas, why did you damage the clothes? I just told you why. He... No, you said you were upset. Yes, I was upset. But that's not a reason he, to damage... He, he threw me out. He threw me out. He seen me grabbing my stuff. As I'm grabbing my stuff, telling him, like, OK, I'm leaving. Instead of him leaving me alone, letting me get my stuff and letting me go like he told me to, he, he's grabbing my stuff. He's being provoking. He, you, you just want to throw me out. You know how I feel about this. And he, we have communicated with each other how things make, make us feel. And he told me the only reason why he throw me out in the first place is because he know it makes me feel some type of way. So he does this person. See how emotional? See, It doesn't time. matter. And every then time. I'm pregnant at that. It does not matter. It's her excuse now. This is what he does. He's, he's not considerate of how I feel. And even at times when we're into it and everything, I shut, I shut down just so it doesn't go far. There's no stopping with him. 